Good morning. Good Sunday morning. The Lord's Day. Today we gather as the body of Christ and draw strength from one another and from our Lord Jesus Christ. Acts 27, 20 verse 7. On the first day of the week when we were gathered together to break bread, Paul talked with them. In Revelation 1.10, John said, I was in the Spirit on the Lord's day, and I heard behind me a loud voice like a trumpet, and he turned around and saw Jesus on the Lord's day. Sunday morning, the Lord's day, the time to gather together to worship, to encourage one another, to pray with one another, to spend time in the Word of God together, just to fellowship as the body of Christ. The body of Christ. His presence. We are strengthened when the body of Christ gathers on the Lord's day. And there's the promise in Matthew 18, 20 uh, of the presence of Jesus in our midst when we gather in his name. Hebrews 10, 23 through 25. Let us hold fast the confession of our hope without wavering. For he who promised is faithful. And let us consider one another to in order to stir up love and good works, not forsaking the assembling of ourselves together, as is the manner of some, but exhorting one another, and so much the more, as you see the day approaching, the day of his return, the end of the age. We're to gather more. Let's pray. Our gracious God and Father, I approach your throne today knowing that it is only through the name of Jesus that I can stand before you. I thank and praise you for your gifting and your calling on my life and for your unmerited favor and grace. I come before you to seek your presence today in our church and in every church in our community, in our city. Bless your pastors and elders with your mighty presence as they teach and preach your word in our community today. Be with me, Lord. Prepare my own heart for Sunday morning when you speak to us as your people. Extend your gracious forgiveness to me that I might come before you with a clean heart. Renew a right spirit within me, Lord. Keep the truth ever before me that to obey is better than sacrifice. Help me to be obedient to you in all things today, this morning. Grant, Lord, that I may be filled with your Holy Spirit, that I may serve you by serving others in our church. And, Lord, let me speak for you today, not just about you. Give us your word for today, for our congregation, Lord. In each and every church, Lord, give your word for this hour, for such a time as this. Let the power of your great grace rest upon all who gather in your name today, Jesus. In the name of the one who desires to present his church to himself, a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle. In Jesus Christ's name, amen.